Every fall semester, I walk into my class on the first day of the new term, and I tell the hundreds of students sitting in that auditorium that we are a team, that we are gonna work together so that we can learn, so that we can grow, we are gonna celebrate each other, and we're gonna come together to ensure that everyone can succeed and that everyone can thrive. Even though things will be a little different on campus this fall, there's still a lot for us to look forward to this school year. I know that I'm excited to get started with my classes, and I hope that you are too. Hello, Washu Bears. How are you? Long time no see. Even with social distancing, we are looking forward to forming a strong bonding with all of you this fall. It's awfully quiet without you students, so we're really excited about you coming back to campus. We need you back, and we're looking forward to having you here and making life much more exciting and engaging. Bienvenue. Welcome back to St. Louis a town founded by the French in 1764. If you reacted to this statement, positively or negatively, I look forward to great discussion in my classroom on campus. After the last few months, I think faculty and students alike will be really bringing a different perspective to how they engage with each other this fall in a world that just keeps changing. Now, these are all things that we care deeply about in arts and sciences. The importance of a different vantage point, the opportunities and uncertainty, and the idea of education as fundamentally grounded in personal connection. It has been so inspiring to see our faculty this summer preparing for the fall semester with that same spirit of discovery and drive towards enhancing community that we so appreciate in our students. Hi everyone, I'm Eli Reddig and I teach courses on energy politics and energy security in the Middle East and on Israeli foreign policy. And this semester I'm going to give my courses remotely. So for example, this semester I'm giving a course called International Energy Politics. And every week we're doing a live Zoom session where we dive into a country as a case study, understand how its energy needs and energy sector is shaping its national security agenda. What I'm going to do is bring government officials from that country to come into the Zoom meeting and talk to the students. So senior security officials from Israel and government officials from Nigeria and people from the energy sector in Iraq are going to come in and talk. And this is on top of our discussion groups and breakout sessions and asynchronous work and media. This is going to be a really cool course. This semester, I am excited to be teaching the global AIDS epidemic and I'll be teaching it using a hybrid format, meaning students will have an in-person component or they can choose to take it completely remotely. In the course, we use the global HIV epidemic into understanding how illness and health are not merely biological, but also are intertwined with social, economic, political, and historical phenomena. We also will apply the course's lessons to other emerging diseases and pandemics, such as the COVID pandemic. Even though this semester will be like no other, it certainly opens up a world of learning opportunities and discoveries. We look forward to seeing you. Classrooms are going to look very different this fall, but I hope that many of the experiences that you're looking forward to at Washington University will feel the same. There may be a lot of changes this fall, but there is one thing that will never change, and that's our commitment to bringing you the best possible learning environment. Hi, I'm John Shureshi, and I'm a professor in the Department of Mathematics and Statistics. Along with my colleagues, I spent a lot of time preparing online classes that should be enjoyable and educational for all students. I'm looking forward to the upcoming semester. I know this will be a bit of an uncertain time for us, but I think together, we the faculty and you the students can work together to make it a success. I'm really looking forward to doing that with you. See you soon. Hope to see you soon. We want our team back. I'm looking forward to seeing you all virtually this fall. I can't wait to connect with you both inside and outside of the classroom, and I will see you soon.